Hello! Today I'm going to show you how to suspend users in bulk from your domain. You probably already know how to import users using a spreadsheet and your admin console, but when it comes to removing users and the tiresome deprovisioning process, it can be a little trickier to work in bulk. So, in the admin console, if we click into users, we see a list of our users. So what if you want to suspend the user instead, and then delete them at a later time? You can do this one user at a time, by clicking the three dots next to a single user, and then scrolling down and clicking Suspend User. Or you can do this in bulk, by using the third-party application, BetterCloud. So let's flip over to BetterCloud, so I can show you how this is done. From the home page in BetterCloud, click into Directory, and under Users, click Explore. This will present you with the same list of users you got in the admin console, and you'll be able to apply filters here if you need to narrow things down to a specific subset of users. We don't need to worry about that at the moment, however, because we're going to export the list of users to a spreadsheet and then suspend them in bulk. So click on the Export to a Spreadsheet button here, then confirm the export. It might take a few minutes depending on how many users you have, but eventually, in your inbox, you'll get a link to the spreadsheet that contains your users. So let's open that up, and you'll see all of your users, which you can, of course, sort and manipulate however you need to in order to find the users you want to suspend. So, to suspend a user, go to column I and type in the word suspend. Of course, if you want to suspend multiple users, you can just drag the suspension down or copy and paste it to apply the status in bulk. We're also going to change column J to hide instead of show, which will remove these users from the directory so other users aren't emailing them while they're suspended. Now that we've updated the spreadsheet, take note of the title of the spreadsheet before we flip back over to BetterCloud. Now under Directory, go to Users and choose Update. From the drop-down menu, select the spreadsheet that we were just working on. If you don't see it, hit this Refresh icon to refresh your options. Then I'll click this box to get emailed when the task is complete. Finally, I'll click on Update Users to start the process. Currently, you can see the check mark next to this user's name, which means that they are active. But if we wait a while and refresh the page, you'll see that the user is suspended. This means that they cannot log into their account or use it anymore. But their data is all still there, so you can transfer ownership or otherwise address data associated with their accounts. And that's how you suspend users in bulk. Hopefully you found that helpful. If you have any questions, just let us know in the comments section below. Thanks so much for watching, and have a great day!